we have a new toy. The ultimate goal of my channel is to actually get a camera at some point, but for right now I am using my um, cell phone for the moment, but I figured if I'm going to be using my cell phone, let me turn this right side up so you can see it, um, I should get something to help balance it out a little bit better. So I ordered, um, a lot of people really saw really, really good things about the Sima Mounts. Um, um, there's one called the Sima Mount Pro, which is no longer made, and I think it's selling for hundreds of dollars now on eBay and stuff, and I'm just not paying that much for this. But, um, so I just went with the second best thing I could, which is a Sima Mount, which this thing right here is very sturdy. I mean, this is very heavy. Um, I've already taken it out of the package, but I figured we'd unwrap it today and look at it and see where everything is. I'm not going to really do any B-roll with this because I want to get back and just do a comparison, honestly, with you. But I would just like to show you what it is. Um, we'll go ahead and open it up here. Um, this is just a little slip cover. And it comes in this little box. And you open it up. And like I said, I've already opened it up. I've been using it a little bit. I filmed something else earlier today, which will go up after this. But um, we have in the case, came with a um, pair of straps, which I've already attached to it. It makes it very easy to carry around, honestly. But this is it. It is made from some aluminum or something. It's very heavy. It's actually um, put me on the search for a um, tripod, an actual tripod. I want to get one um, because I feel like I'm probably going to have to set that here on the floor and use a, an actual honest to goodness tripod now. Um, which is going to create all sorts of new um, things for me to do. Um, another thing it's doing is I have to really reinvent how I use my lighting because um, the way I had them set up in here before is just not going to work anymore with this because it has a wide angle lens, which it comes in here with this. But here it is. It's the little chassis. It's um, like a camera. It holds. It's got a nice little grip right here. Um, I actually do like the wooden grip a little bit better. I just like that aesthetic, honestly. But um, this is still really good. It's got a little level on the top of it. Um, you've got a button to snap a photo. You got a button to record movies. You got a button to zoom in and zoom out. And um, you can also switch the camera out, I, I believe. Um, there's another camera mode on this, apparently. But yeah, this is um, everything it is. Um, it has little grips here. You can loosen and adjust here. I've got this set to where my um, the lens is on my camera, so I don't want to move that right now. But you can take this right here and adjust it a little bit. Um, just roll this out and take a little bit, and there you go. Um, I don't need that much for my phone. It's not that big. I'm running an S9 right now, but I do need a little bit when I do it. Um, the other thing is um, it also comes with this. A wide angle lens and my DVDs are falling <laughs> um, there's a wide angle lens here which open up and see the little um, wide angle lens it comes with a um but this is um, mounted on top of a macro lens as well which I unscrew here and show you here this is a macro lens so a wide angle lens is sitting on top of it so all you have to do is sit um, unscrew this and you'll have a macro lens so you can get some really nice close-up shots if you want to. That's more for photography than it is for what I'm going to do with it. Um, the fingerprint smudge on this. So we want to get that off before we record our next part. But yeah, this is everything here. Um, I'm actually going to show you here in just a moment what it looks like with um, with the lens and everything attached. Um, so I will see y'all in a minute. And I'm back with the wide-angle lens now. What do you think of the difference? I mostly like it. The only thing complaint I have about the wide angle lens is there is a little bit on these sides that are look like a little bit of dreamy look to it, but it's so small that it doesn't really matter. So I'm actually I'm actually okay with it. So um it is something that I can deal with until I get a new camera and for um fortunately. But um anyways guys, let me know what you think. Um I'm actually really enjoying this thing. I'm going to be taking it out more. Um, Wednesday night, I'm actually going to be taking a trip to Raleigh, so I plan on taking this with me and taking my rig with me. Only complaint, I really wish you, um, hopefully I can find one in Raleigh. I want to get a shoe mount so I can put my um, 
Rode Video Micro on the top of it and be able to carry it around with me without having to carry it like I did today because it was very uncomfortable, honestly. But other than that, this thing is great. It's a lot more balanced. It gives me more space. It makes me look, makes my um, screen look wider and more depth, honestly. I've really enjoyed this so far. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I should be back with our next video. It's going to be my trip to... Um, my trip to free comic book day which has already been filmed but that's going to be the next one you see after this anyways guys have a good one thanks a lot